Hello, what's up, what's up my people? Welcome and welcome back to our channel Mo and Mpime World. It's your girl Mpime here and today I have another amazing video just for you guys. Yeah, so if you're new here, kindly click the subscribe button and click the notification button as well so that you can be notified anytime we upload a new video. And for our returning subscribers, thank you so much for your love and your support. So today, uh, I'm in the village, as you can see behind me. I'm in a farm, actually, a sorghum farm. And I want to take you around this farm so that we can get to know one, two, three about sorghum and sorghum farming and all. Eh? So stay tuned. Eh? to the end of this video like it comment let's do this so guys let's start here as you can see this is a sorghum plant eh? this is a sorghum plant as you can see here there are different colors like this one is is ready very ready to be harvested as you can see and in between this farm actually they love planting cassava as you can see this is a cassava plant yeah it's not yet ready it's still young yeah but as for the sorghum like you can see here the sorghum plantation is ready it's ready to be harvested yeah yeah so let me take you around here so that you can see but in here there are some which did not grow so well eh? as you all know that uh, whenever you plant there are those plants that will grow to maturity and you'll harvest but there are some that will spoil eh? like this one now this one did not even produce any sorghum as you can see here yeah it's still green and it doesn't have the granules like these ones you see these ones are ready and the ones which are still like white they are not that reddish eh? like the, the other ones eh? hope you can see hope you can see so well here the ones that are still whitish they are not yet ready so we they are not yet ready for harvesting we will wait for it to mature and harvest it and yeah, sorghum, mostly they use it to to cook ugali. Hmm? They make sorghum and cassava ugali. This is cassava plant and maize, uh, not maize, sorghum. So this combination usually makes a very good ugali. Like the brown ugali is made out of this. Eh? You can see. Hmm? If you want brown ugali, you need such a plantation yeah for you to make a very good brown ugali and you know that whenever you mix it with cassava hey and in here there is also maize so there's some maize eh? a little bit of maize as you can see here but not as many as the sorghum plantation and the cassava like uh, eh, there is a row of cassava plants and there's also a row of sorghum as you can see here yeah so let me take you around so that you can see how ugali where ugali comes from sorghum this is sorghum and uh, i want to educate you here a little bit a little bit of farming <laughs> education and uh, yeah and the nutrition uh, yeah, I want to tell you that sorghum has very many, has very numerous uh, benefits, especially health-wise. It's very nutritious and delicious and it can also fight so many diseases. Eh? This sorghum you see here, it's not only a uh, food only for consumption and satisfaction only. Eh? It also has numerous health benefits. For example... Uh, sorghum can help in fighting uh, cancer also it helps in fighting diabetics that's why you see mo most people who have that, that issue or they have 
uh, they are diabetic they use brown ugali they don't use the maize ugali and water view or any other type of ugali they use the sogam ugali yeah the brown ugali i told you that the sogam ugali comes brown eh? so the sogam makes it brown so in terms of fighting such diseases and helps in uh, it also helps in weight loss yeah sogam is very good for weight loss like these seeds eh? should i call them seeds really yeah they are very good in weight loss when you eat such ugali or such any meal prepared from sorghum it will help you in managing your weight eh? or fight your uh, in losing your losing weight if, if you are maybe conditions like being obese or obesity in general yeah so it helps you in fighting in losing weight yeah mm -hmm. another thing another impo importance or health benefit of the sorghum it helps in fighting inflammation you all know that some some meals when you you take some meals you you get some heat eh, around your throat and from your stomach and what have you so when you take sorghum you'll hear none of those eh? none of inflammation and heart burns and what have you so it's a very good meal in fighting and combating inflammation yeah guys so you should make sorghum your friend as you can see here, there are so many cassavas as well. I told you, they are cassava. This one, this one is bad now. This one, this is bad. It has spoiled, eh? and at this line, it seems that they didn't come out well. As you can see here, those ones are not good. Yeah. And it's a it's it's a fiber like the sorghum has contains fiber, so it helps in your digestive system. Yeah, that's why some people when they eat the sorghum cassava, they take so long, like they become full for a long time. Yeah, you don't you don't just feel hunger here and there, huh? It will take you long. Like when, if you eat brown ugali now. It will take you more than five or more hours. Those kukula tena, so that you can get, you get hungry. Hmm? Yeah. So it's very good. It's a very good meal. Eh? In addition, sorghum is a gluten-free meal or plant, so it helps also. Yeah, things to do with weight and what have you hmm? it's gluten free doesn't contain gluten so it's a very good meal for consumption also it also sorghum helps in heart diseases like if you take sorghum it's cholesterol free and you know if you know you know most cholesterol free plants are very good in making your heart healthy in healthy condition your heart will stay in health, health healthy condition if you consume meals made from sorghum yeah this is how sorghum looks like like the granules as you can see so I think this one is ready to be harvested. You see the difference between this and this. This one is so ready. This one is not yet, but can also be harvested. At least it came out well. And like this one, this one here, people have gone for loss. They have incurred loss here. As you can see, there are no seeds as these ones. This one is empty. It's empty. It's empty. It's still, it's still just flowers. Eh? There are no seeds. Eh? Yeah, as you can see. 
yeah uh, guys and there is also another health benefit of sorghum plant and meals if you consume meals coming from these sorghum hmm, it helps in bone health eh? like your bones eh? it helps keep them strong and healthy yeah if you consume we take in sorghum in whatever form that you wish to it will help in your bone health that is what i mean is uh, the sorghum has high levels of magnesium and magnesium also helps in maintaining the levels of calcium in your body yeah and you all know that calcium and bones are these eh? they are friends eh? so if you have high levels of calcium you you definitely know that your bones are super healthy and good yeah so if you consume sorghum or meals coming from this sorghum you will have very good bones eh? and bones are very important for movement and whatever yeah keeps you strong eh? as a person as a human being yes guys mm -hmm. so yeah apart from being consumed as food uh, sorghum can also make ethanol can make syrup and some other medicines yeah it's medicinal as well so yeah you should make uh, sorghum your friend especially in meals like i've told you here in kenya in africa we make it we make ugali using this sorghum and uh, yeah it's very good eh? i've told you that health wise you'll be very good to go like Sorghum contains so many minerals and vitamins, especially vitamins B, vitamin B. Yeah, and you all know what it can do to your body. And apart from that, it also has it contains some potassium, magnesium, eh, phosphorus, iron, and zinc. All these are very good, are very essential in your body. So if you consume this, you will be a uh, healthy human being and uh, hey what's more good than that eh? nothing can beat that like health if you are healthy you are wealthy yeah so these ones as you can see this whole chamber of sorghum has already been harvested eh? and the remaining ones are just the remnants i think they'll be cut for some other uses eh? yeah the whole of this chamber the sorghum has been harvested guys as you can see so guys thank you so much for listening to me for watching this video uh, keep it locked here at more and prime world until next time guys bye don't forget to like it comment and share it with your friends most importantly subscribe subscribe subscribe